think families can function well with a narcissistic parent. I think, again, it depends upon how old the children are, depends on how old the partner is. And we're talking about different aspects. So if first we're talking about partners, so partners, again, have to look at that dynamic. They have to look at that individual. What is the relationship dynamic? What are the needs that are being met or not being met? And what are the maladaptive and pathological patterns that are at work? Now, if we're talking about children, there's something that I call insulation. And I like to teach these to there's something that I call insulation. And I like to teach this to children of narcissists. And it can be at any age. It can be 5, 7, 15, 25, 35, whatever it is. What insulation is, it's building this sense of security outside of that desired need for validation that the narcissistic parent has set up. And I think once insulation is in place and once these children of narcissists are able to build that sense of insulation, they can actually have a relationship with that parent. But we have to radically accept who that parent is. They're not going to be the idealized parent. They're not going to be the good mother or good father that we always wanted. They're going to be the person that they are. And radically accepting that can be very, very challenging. But those are some of the strategies that can help to really function well and create an adaptive environment with a narcissistic partner or parent.